I chose St. Luke's College in Sioux City because of the small class sizes and how amazing the professors are here. I chose St. Luke's College because it provides a more personal experience and it's very close to home. I chose St. Luke's College because um, I had heard from many other people, many other nurses, um, that it was just the best place to get a nursing education with the best hands-on experience as possible. They um, are successful nurses themselves and just talked very highly about the opportunities that St. Luke's had to offer. I chose St. Luke's College because I really wanted that hands-on experience during clinical and I really liked the one-on-one -on -one aspect with the professors. The experience working with the instructors here would be honestly amazing. They're always telling us, hey, if you need help, we're here. There's not a day that goes by that they're not willing to help. I think this is a good place for higher education because uh, we're in the environment and on the spot with the people we need to be with. We're in the lab, wherever we need to be. We have the experience hands-on right away. I've never seen a baby being born before, but I had the opportunity to see that in our OB class. Um, it is just like one of the, the coolest experiences I've ever had, um, especially on the nursing floor. It was so cool, and I think that is just a great part about St. Luke's. You get to see things hands-on um, and just really interact with everything you're doing. Just seeing, like, seeing patients with like a smile on their face, knowing that you did the best you could for them. I think because the college is so close to the hospital, we really get that immediate experience with working with patients. I didn't have any prior patient experience before coming to this college, but really having the class and then also working at the hospital now, it's really provided me with like that comfort level to work with patients. With the experience we have gained here, we've been put into real world situations so soon that we know how to handle them and how to be personable and respond to not only the patients but also family members. A lot of people, when I say medical laboratory science, the first thing they say is, what? And then the second thing they'll ask is, so what is that? And I say, well, you know when you go get your blood drawn or whatever for a routine test and then they say they'll let you know in a couple of days what the results are. Well, someone has to figure out what the results are, so that's us in the lab. We get all the tubes, all the samples, everything. We learn about like image critiquing on how we can evaluate a uh, radiograph and what we can do to make it better. Um, we also learn about radiation protection, radiation safety, um, general patient care, radiographic like physics and everything behind that on how we can really produce an uh, adequate image or an image that's um, able to be uh, read and diagnosed. So the respiratory program is basically a two-year crash course of how to be a respiratory therapist. We learn a lot of stuff that a lot of people don't know about. The best advice I've been given to be passionate about what you do and to just be kind. They can't really teach you how to be empathetic, but just the way they care for us shows how we should care for our patients.